Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. Uh, we just had to uh, restart our battle because he only chose three Pokemon instead of six. Um, so, you know, our, he's bringing a, a Mousehold, Tinkaton, Espeon, Noiburn, Delphox, and Meloetta. Uh, feel free to like and subscribe, all that fun stuff. I better make sure I click Corviknight there. Uh, we're going to start off with Witch Cash because I, th I don't think, uh, even with Espeon or Tinkaton as a lead, um, I don't think it matters really because we have the EQ for it even if Noivern wants to switch we do have Stone Edge to hit it as well so but yeah he only brought three last time hopefully he brings a full team of six okay there we go okay now we're playing for reals uh, we did see each other's lead so hopefully by honor code we stick with the same ones yeah okay so it's Noivern versus Goonch uh, I don't know what this Noivern wants to do really so I'm just going to click Stone Edge. He might think I'm D-Dance, so we'll just click Stone Edge. Wow, there's normal gem in this game. Interesting. And we'll land our Stone Edge, not quite knocking it out. Now the problem is he's going to click, click it again, right? Do we go in with Grey Road now? I feel like Grey Road's going to be important in this battle. Um, let's see if we check our targets here. If I do that, he probably goes in a Tinkaton. Which, if we do that, we can... We might be able to find another chance to set up with our rocks later on. So I think I'll make the choice and go into Grey Room. I think rocks would be important. It's just finding that opportunity to set it up. And here's his Dragon Post. Good read on him. We'll eat that hit very well. So now our play should be to click Willow. Yeah. Is he either going to switch or he's, you know, not? Oh, there's the taunt. So we went for the Willow thinking that's fine if he taunts us. That's fine. I still get leftover recovery. So now I think we click Hex. So he's probably gonna go take a ton and set up rocks or something like that. I'm not gonna send in Wish Cash. Not yet at least. So here's the withdrawal. There's the Tinkaton, as expected. And there's that Mold Breaker we see. So we're gonna go for our Neutral Hex. So that does a little chunk of damage. This might be Spadef. He's definitely gonna click Play Rough. Or something like that. Um, it's either that or he clicks Rocks. But I do think we go into Goonch here. You do see it's an offensive, um, offensive one. Okay, that's fine. We're just gonna click EQ. I don't think we're gonna get our rocks up. Actually, I, I even I think we just got a beta move here. I don't want to risk a thunder wave. There's a play rough. We probably could have gone Corvi. That probably would have been the better play. But I think we're fine. I think we're okay. Um. So our next move is Golden Corvus right now. And with that, he's probably going to go into Delphox. We got to calm down a bit here. So we're going to just click... Actually, or do we just get off Body Press? I think we get off a of Body Press. There's the Gigaton Hammer. It's going to do nothing to us. And there's that body press gonna do a lot of damage. If he switches out, that's fine. Um, because we're he's either gonna click protect or he's gonna click um play rough. So we know all four of his moves. I don't th I think he has boots on. So he might be able to click Gigaton again. 
Um, I think what we'll do is we'll we'll click. He might he's probably thinking body press again. So what we'll do is we'll roost. Yeah. We'll roost. Get a recovery off so we can preserve this thing against tandem mouse and whatnot. So now we can click body press. And even if he switches out, that's fine. We gotta get some damage off. There's another source that thinking I'm gonna bulk up or something. Body press should knock out Tinkaton here. Yeah, okay, Tinkaton's gone. Okay, so we're one for one right now with a very, very damaged Noivern. So Delphox is probably gonna come out next. Yeah, here comes that Delphox. And it's probably going to click Flamethrower. So, do we go back? No, we don't go back. So, we have a big Psychic weakness right now. Delphox hits our team very, very hard. If he has D-Gleam good on him. We'll switch out into Grey Road, simply because that is our special wall. And even if he decides to switch out, we can go for Pain Split if we take too much damage. Here's a Terra. Terra Fairy. Terra Fire. So he's going for the kill with that flamethrower. Oh, he's going for a flame charge. That's fine. He's going to outspeed now. So we can click Dark Pulse for free now, now that um, the Kain's gone, Tinkaton's gone. So we're going to click Dark Pulse. And obviously not clicking Willow, we have to click a move. Uh, even if he airs Flamethrower, we should be able to eat it, no problem. That crit definitely matters, okay. Okay, that puts us in a weird position now. Mm. Do we go Supernova here? I think we do. I think we're forced to Terra and then Grass move it. We have Cork Drive, he obviously has Psychic, like it's no secret. I think we have the Terra here. And I think we have to click Agility. I think that's our only play here. If he predicts me, it's GG. We have a shot if he clicks Psychic. Okay, we do have a shot. Okay. So we're at plus two. Let's click that sludge wave. Oh, we don't knock it out. What the fuck? Oh, we have a shadow sneak, so we're fine. That's fine. Dang, Iron Moth couldn't knock out Delphox from that range. That's unfortunate. Well, at least Delphox is weaker now. So we can go into Kumquat. And we're just going to click Shadow Sneak. I mean, if he brings in Tandem Mouse, he brings in Tandem Mouse. Um, yeah, Fire Psychic is just really good coverage all around. We're going to knock out Delphox here. So the big threat's gone, and we're going to definitely see Espeon come in now. The problem with Espeon is they tend to run Sashes. Oh, and Meloetta too. Hmm. Is our best play just to click Poison Jab? I feel like it is. 
You're probably thrilled, Spray. Another crit. What the hell? Okay, we're getting very unlucky in this match, and I hate it. Two crits like that matter. At least we get the poison off. That's some constellation. Hmm. Okay. Good. Mock, Corviknight, and Bax. I think we have to go Corviknight here. Cause I don't I don't think we can afford to lose Mach yet. And I know we have fully invested. There's that relic song. Okay. It's in its pure wet form right now, so definitely outspeeds, right? So I don't think we have anything to lose if we click body press. I don't think we have anything to lose. Okay, we could we should have just click roost. Your mix. So that'll knock out Meloetta. The problem is we used our Terra, right? So but we still have Espeon to deal with, and the problem is we can't let Espeon set up. Is Tandem Mouse, Espeon, and something else in the back. We gotta be able to deal with it. This is gonna be this is a very, very tough battle. Boba, please be Tandem Mouse. Okay, Espeon. Are you just gonna knock out with Shadow Ball? I don't mind it. If you call mine here, I will hit you with Brave Bird, and we do have Shadow Sneak. That'll do a lot of damage. So we'll see what you do here. Yeah, just straight up Shadow Ball. don't see any item. Oh, we see a life orb. Okay. So I think now we go into backs. Okay, so I think we D-dance. That's our obvious move right now. But we don't outspeed Noivern. Here's D-gleam. Okay, we can live one. Here's our D-Dance. So now, do we click Icicle Spear or we click the Glaive Rush? I don't think Tandem Mouse gets priority. Let's go for the for sure knockout. So Glaive Rush knocks out Espeon. So now it's Tandem Mouse and Noivern. Out comes Noivern. What you already seen was Normal Gem. So now we can click Icicle Spear, no problem. Okay, that's fine. Did we pull off? the turnaround. Did we get the victory here with one Dragon Death? Because he has Tandem Mouse. Tandem Mouse can bring his back. Because Tandem Mouse is very, very quick. Or Tandem Mouse, Mouse Hold. Ooh, I never heard the cry before. That's one creepy cry right there. Glaive Rush, will we knock it out? We will! Holy smokes, Baxcalibur, you monster! Oh my gosh, we go 4-0. Holy cannoli, what a turnaround. Holy smokes, folks. I hope you stayed with that one. Oh, we were on the back foot for most of that battle. We improved the 4-0, folks. That was a really, really juicy battle. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you all next time, my friends. Bye-bye. Holy cannoli.